I basically let's find some good lighting first. Okay, so basically, I'm doing something super duper exciting. I am going to be on Good Morning Britain tomorrow with Ben Shepherd, and I am super excited. They've um, put me and the kids up in a hotel room the night before, so I've just arrived with the kids, and we're going to go in early in the morning, like 6:30. So yeah, this is Camille's just touching everything but yeah so I am absolutely shattered it's 10 o'clock let me give you a quick tour of the room it's just a normal double room yeah it's like a Hilton hotel called Hamptons or something if only it was the actual Hamptons Camille <laughs> he 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 didn't just go pee he's got a nappy on he just likes pressing buttons um okay so this is the bathroom with a shower got a mirror here and then all the suitcases and car seats oh also they um got a cab all the way from Sussex to pick us up and they're gonna take us back as well they've just been so cool yeah um double bed sofa bed so if Ali was to come he would have chucked him on there and then let's have a look outside the view um hmm Flats. <laughs> but yeah, I am gonna get the kids ready for bed and what else? Get all the clothes ironed. Camille, can you switch that on please? Thank you. <laughs> get all the clothes ironed and then go to sleep because we've got a super duper early start. And I'm really excited because they said they'll do my makeup. Yeah! <laughs> oh, so yeah. I'm excited completely and hopefully I can vlog it. But yeah, see you in the morning. Ordered pizza because I'm absolutely starving. It's like 10 pounds for this. It better be big. Oh my god, it's tiny for ten pounds. Oh, you do when you're hungry. Do what you gotta do. Let's eat, baby. Mm. Sorry, I think my taxi driver's here. But um, I'm ready. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Um, the kids are still sleeping. I've got to leave in twenty minutes, but quickly. So I'll show you my outfit. just a maxi shirt with like a bodycon and leggings on underneath um i wear my half a scarf better obviously um but yeah kids are still sleeping it's tiring but yeah let's, let's get on with the day and inshallah it's gonna be good i've just got to remember i'm doing it for all you sisters out there that have ever struggled with the hijab and been abused like we need to break the barriers and just you know raise a better next generation because that's our duty so we you know we got this guys we can do it so yeah i've got to get off see you in a bit i you know i don't know what it's going to be like so um inshallah oh there's a door there <laughs> inshallah i have i can vlog it and stuff but yeah we'll see i love this mirror ali i need one We're all in the car, we're all ready. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just vlogging. <laughs> um, oh God, this is real now. I'm actually going in. I'm so scared. Um, kids are being perfect so far. There's Asiya. There's Kama. So yeah. Ooh, let's see how today goes.
been all set and prepped, makeup done, and I'm in the green room now with the kids and everyone else. Oh, I'm super nervous. I've got the stuff ready for Susanna and Ben to try on. We'll see if they try it. But um, yeah, Camille has found the fruit. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. Okay, hey guys. That is like I'm just with Ben and Susanna on the hey couch. Lily. <laughs> I've just done my segment. I hope you guys watched it. I hope I was okay. I was very nervous. I felt they were very mean to me. What do you think? Were you guys mean? I think we were, I think we were pretty fair and balanced. Pretty fair, to be what honest. What did you learn? You um, you held your own. We learned there are lots of different interpretations of whether you should wear the hijab and the niqab. And, and you should feel like going and saying hello to someone and talking about the headscarf and why women or uh, Muslim women feel they would like to wear it and why they enjoy wearing it as well. Okay, good. I thought I'd put you on the spot as well. And also that Lily's got greasy hair. <laughs> no, I she don't. I washed my hair today. Hair. Look. I, wa <laughs> <laughs> I washed my hair today, I promise. <laughs> Thank you so much for having me. You were awesome. Thanks Thank so you. much. Bye. Bye. So I've just done all that. Oh, we're going to go home now. So, right. been a long day. Oh, look, it's Michael. Do you mind being my vlog? No, of course not. Say hi. You did a great hello. You did a great job, by the way. Yeah, did you, did you enjoy oh, it? Fantastic, yeah, absolutely. How do you feel about the challenge? Do you know what, I think it's a fantastic challenge. Yeah. I think it's about time that people took up took up this big challenge yes. and went to see exactly what it's like to live around society and walking down the streets day to day. Perfect. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you so much. Yeah, you're welcome. Good to see you. Have a good time. Bye. <laughs> Michael. Oh. Right, I'm lost now. Where were we? Oh. How cool is that? There's a big... Where is it? Oh, Ben Shepard, that is so cool. <laughs> right, come on then. Right, let's get our stuff and we can go. Yeah? Right. hotel now and I have had such a wonderful morning it is ridiculous how wonderful it's been um oh literally I hope you guys watched it I'm going to try and include some segments in the vlog um if I had done it would have been before this in it anyway so yeah I've just had a wonderful time oh my goodness I want to be a tv presenter <laughs> but honestly I absolutely loved it and look Oh no, I'm just so tired now. It's like, um, it's not even, it's like just turn eight. So, oh, so good. And I really hope I portrayed myself well. I know I'm going to get a few hate comments because, you know, it happens. But, um, inshallah, people are more aware of the hijab and to approach a mum. I don't, 
Like, I was told to do my key messages, but, like, do you know what? They just threw you all out. Oh. But, yeah, I'm just glad it's over now, and, inshallah, someone will approach you and not be afraid of your hijab, because that's the most important thing. Whoa. But, yeah, I'm just going to tidy up now. Oh no, I look fat. You laid down this challenge. Yeah. Kira took it up. Now, she didn't experience a negative reaction. But of course, Kira doesn't go out in one every day. No. Um, what do you experience um, regularly? On a day to day basis, absolutely fine. I get all my things. But um, I feel like that's because in my village, everyone knows me. But it's when I go somewhere else, like my husband tells me, oh, they're just staring at you, kind of thing. But um, when I went to France, people were staring at me, which is quite new over there. Hey guys, so I'm packed, I'm ready to go, I've had such a wonderful time, thank you so much to ITV, Channel Mom, um, Sense Communications, um, everyone's just been so helpful, so amazing, and oh, I've just absolutely loved this whole entire adventure. Um, I, I'm so glad my babies were with me and could enjoy it with me. It's just been so lovely. Why is it all blurry? There we go. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to call the cab to take us all the way back to Brighton. And then I might um, sleep. But I really should vlog and uh, edit my vlogs. I haven't uploaded for a while. And... Um, <laughs> just go through all the messages that you guys have sent me because I'm just so overwhelmed by the love that you guys have for me <gasps> like honestly you guys are so sweet um and of course I couldn't do any of it without you guys your support your sharing your encouragement your comments just uh, spread the word about the hijab challenge and inshallah we can break the barrier and like let people see that we are just normal people so yeah bye for now to come pick us up um it's been such a lovely day. i know i keep saying it but it has been really like a lovely day i have it's been such a wonderful adventure with my babies but it's been so exhausting like oh my god camille he just runs ahead he's really fast and i'm carrying asia carrying the bags okay. and do you know what in this hotel it's really nice and everything but they're really unhelpful they saw me struggle carrying both my babies a massive changing bag and my handbag and nobody helped me I was like what on earth um so yeah I don't know about that but um I suppose I, sw I thought they're meant to be hospitable here but oh well um I'm just looking forward to getting home now sleeping in the car um let me know your comments below on how you thought I did um I thought they're really hard questions <laughs> I really felt like I was put on the spot, but yeah. Um, yeah I'm really tired now, I just want to go home.
so I'm back now from London, um, need to unpack, oh, it's been such a hectic, I think I worked out at, it was like 18 hours I've been out of the house, so, oh, shattered, such a wonderful time, I know I keep saying it, but I'm just so like overwhelmed by how amazing it was, it was such a whirlwind of an adventure, and I got to take my little babies with me, so, that was difficult, so difficult, but you know what, I loved it and I tried not to stress about it, so yeah, hope you enjoyed the video, um, Good Morning Britain have already uploaded it on their YouTube, so make sure you check out the actual hijab challenge that I did on over on Channel Mum, I'll include the link somewhere here, and make sure you check out the actual clip, um, that Good Morning Britain have uploaded onto their YouTube. I'll include the link somewhere. I need to work on how to do this, but I'll do something here. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed it. And if you've just come over for the first time, hi guys! Um, please do subscribe to my channel, and I hope you follow me on my journey. And do you want to see what Camille is doing? Mama, sit there. Sit there. Basically, obviously, I take the car seats and the taxi drivers just drop them all off. So, yeah. Thank you so much for being part of my journey with the hijab challenge. I am so grateful that I got to do it and that you guys were able to get me there and stuff. Because I wouldn't have done it without any of you guys, like, encouraging me, supporting me, saying I'm inspiring. Which I'm not, by the way. I'm just doing what is right. So, guys, I hope you're proud of me, and I think that's it. So, thanks, guys. Bye.